Hi, my name is Art Kirsch. I'm co-founder of Celebrating Act Two, a website and YouTube channel dedicated to people 50 and over because they're living longer, healthier lives. And um, unlike their parents and grandparents, they might have not just 10 or 15 years in front of them, but 20, 30, perhaps even 40 years or more in front of them. So we're sort of like the user manual for the second half of your life now that you've got so much uh, uh, potential in front of you. In any event, we do about 300 interviews a year uh, via the internet, uh, primarily using uh, Skype and some other software. And uh, we provide uh, information about health and uh, finances and travel, uh, some nostalgia uh, uh, with movies and uh, TV and uh, that kind of stuff. And we also interview people who are doing new and exciting things in the second half of their life, uh, if you will, their second act. In any event, uh, John Coleman and I don't do many uh, product reviews. Uh, unless we come across something that's uh, we think so important, especially for uh, the people in our audience that are retired who might have a fixed income or a low income than they had in earlier days and uh, therefore don't um, uh, maybe have as much expendable uh, funds uh, or would like to get something uh, equivalent for less money. And uh, I recently uh, determined that I wanted to have a, a tablet to take to the gym uh, because I like to go about four or five days a week. Uh, I do about an hour, an hour and a half of cardio on a recumbent bike, and I like to read uh, a book uh, or two uh, uh, during those sessions and uh, to watch uh, and listen to my favorite uh, business channel. So uh, uh, one of the problems with the, even the best gyms, and I go to a gym that has really, really good equipment, is that um, uh, they get the equipment right, which is great to do exercise, but most of them can't do anything uh, about maintaining their TVs or their entertainment feeds uh, into uh, either their equipment or up on the wall, and uh, that's always a mess. The only thing they seem to get right is an internet connection. So I determined that I would get a, uh, a tablet. Uh, I have... Uh, uh, a streaming service called Dish Anywhere, and um, I knew that there was an application that I could put on virtually any tablet uh, because there are uh, app stores like the Apple Store or, or uh, Google Play. And uh, so uh, I decided that I was going to go get a, a tablet. And uh, one of the people that uh, John and I work with on a lot of different projects, uh, I'll just uh, call it Grace, is sort of like a real uh, technical technically savvy, and uh, even though I'm a, she knows that I'm a PC guy, that's what I use for my business, and that I have uh, an iPhone and I've had uh, uh, Apple tablets in the past, she said, if you want to save some money, you might want to look into an Android product. And I said, oh, I don't want to learn a new operating system. She says, believe me, it, it's easy, and quite frankly, the cost differential is so significant. Uh, you be doing yourself a disservice not to do so. So anyway, about um, uh, the end of last year, I guess it's about six months now, uh, uh, I went to Amazon and I started looking up Android tablets. I knew that I wanted one that was about 10 inches uh, because that would give me a nice size to be, size to be reading books on. And um, uh, so that's sort of where I started off. And uh, I researched uh, for about four months. I came down to about 12 different devices. And um, uh, I'll be talking about the one that I decided to get. Uh, but it seems that there's a sweet spot in uh, uh, these devices that are about um, uh, four gigabytes of RAM and 64 gigabytes of uh, onboard flash memory. But with Android, the big difference was that they all have, uh, or virtually all of them, have SD micro cards. And in this particular case, uh, you could add an additional 256 gigabyte SD micro card, which means that if I wanted to put some movies up there, let's say I was going on a, a trip on a plane or something where I didn't have uh, internet access, uh, 
or uh, I wanted to continue to add books and things like that so that I'd have them available to me uh, with or without uh, access to the internet. Uh, it would be that comfort zone. I'll probably never use that, uh, but it was a comfort zone because I know that my wife, who does have uh, iPads, is always running out of space because she has tons of uh, uh, photographs up there uh, that she uh, stores there. And uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't do that. I actually take most of my photos on my phone and I transfer it to my computer. But that's another story. So in any event, uh, of these 12 units, uh, the uh, SEBI S23, is that it? Yeah. SEBI S23 was my choice. In addition to everything else, its screen was a little bit larger. Most of them were 10 or 10.1 inches. This was 10.36 inches. Uh, they all had, uh, at least of the 12 that I was following, they all had really solid reviews um, and, and lots of them. They weren't just a few here or there. Um, uh, SEBI had some additional things. It had um, a, uh, uh, a two-year warranty instead of the standard one-year warranty or six-month warranties. And uh, so when push came to shove, there were so many different bits and pieces and combinations, I decided to get the SEBI. And the, the, uh, I had a little trepidation, but I'm a, a, an Amazon Prime member for many years, and I figured they'd either let me return it if it really wasn't up to par or a first small restocking fee. And for $100, what can I lose? So... Uh, anyway, I ordered one. The next day it came in. And the first thing I noticed was its packaging. And its packaging was a quality package. How do I know it was a quality package? Well, for years I've been getting other manufacturers' quality packages. Uh, and in the case of the iPhones, I had now uh, three or four. I kept the boxes and I store stuff in it in the back of my drawer. Why? Because I like when I take them out. It reminds me of the quality that I used to get packaged in this kind of box. And the SEBI, same exact thing. Same exact thing. So it came in a quality packaging. If you needed to contact them for any reason, big print on the back of the box, here I am. You need me, contact me. And quite frankly, the only thing I needed to contact them for was I didn't know how to get on uh, to uh, uh, make sure I was there for a two-year warranty. And I sent them an email, and within 24 hours, I had an answer back, and there you go. So uh, I had my two-year warranty. I didn't have to worry about it. And um, uh, I know that uh, SEBI, I, I found a little bit more information about them, uh, is part of a, a company that actually makes tablets onto several different brands. Uh, uh, this is the one that I happened to get. But uh, I was uh, so pl pleased with the way it came in. And then it was just the question, well, how does it operate? And quite frankly, I've had it now for about eight weeks, three, four, five days a week, depending upon the other activities I'm doing. A week, it goes to the gym with me. And this is it. It's, whoop, oh, get rid of the... I had it plugged in. It's solid as a, as a rock. Just absolutely flawless operationally. And it even comes with this nice little case so that when I get to the gym, I can just put it down. And uh, let me just show you here. I'm going to turn it on and put in my password. And here we go. Uh, this happens to be running on my uh, application called Dish Anywhere. It's the afternoon uh, series of uh, business uh, uh, shows uh, on here. And then if I wanted to, uh, I could just find the additional programs that are on here. Uh, it has a, a square and a, a, a circle and a arrow. Arrow goes to the last application. The circle goes to the home page. And the um, square opens up the other applications that I have open. Here is one, is a book that I'm reading by uh, Tom Hanks. And it probably won't show very well on here, but I continue to listen to my business program on my AirPods, 
because I don't want to be connected with the nice set of headphones that they sent me that work just fine. But when I'm at the gym, the air, I think they call AirPods, work just great. And then I can just read my book. And then when I'm finished with that, and I'm a happy guy. So uh, that, that case is the business, but uh, I can actually watch movies or anything else that I get on my, my Dish Anywhere service. Uh, in addition to that, and I thought I was going to use this a lot, and I hardly use it at all because it's so easy to use the, uh, uh, the tablet uh, and the on-screen uh, entries, is uh, they give you a keyboard and they give you a mouse, Bluetooth. Uh, I picked up a, an SD card. I actually had one here, but I ordered another one to replace it. And I put in a 256 gigabyte card. Um, and then that's it. It just works. It's solid. I've had it for eight weeks now. Um, not returning it. I love it. And uh, I paid, I think, with California, where I live, uh, there's a, a steep sales tax. So I, I probably paid about $102 uh, uh, delivered to me. And I couldn't be happier. So if you are willing not to be in your comfort zone, if you're an Android user, this is a no-brainer. Because this was only about, let's see, uh, it's around 100 $250, $300 for brand name Android products. Uh, I was over at Costco today, which is a local uh, warehouse, uh, a shopping warehouse, and they had um, uh, some Apple products there, and they had a 10-inch version of this with not even 256 gigabytes of memory for sure, uh, and they were around um, $700, $800. So while there's a, you know, a range of prices that you can pay for other things, for... What I want for the gym, this is perfect. And with the Google Play Store, my grandkids will be able to uh, load up all the popular applications that they have uh, uh, when they come over to visit, like Minecraft and things with candy and stuff like that, which I don't, I don't use it, don't understand, but they love it, so that's great. They'll be using it when uh, I'm doing some work at home and they're in the other room. And... Um, uh, I even uh, was able to like, do continuing education uh, at a local college, and they use something called Canvas and Zoom uh, to uh, gain access to their online classes. Even those were available. They're all the popular applications. So uh, this is a, a no-lose situation. And uh, let me just say one other thing uh, about this. Uh, my biggest concern was that I was in the computer graphics industry for... 25 to 30 years, and I know about screen resolutions, and, and uh, I my, my home computer has a very high resolution, our TVs do, but this only had 1332 by 800 um, as a resolution, and I was a little concerned about it until I got it, and when I got it, I realized that the engineers and the marketing team at SEBI found just the right amount of expensive uh, screen and and memory that they needed in order to have crystal clear, perfect color all the time. Uh, it's for a 10-inch screen. 15, 20 inch, you probably want higher resolution, but not for this. And they will eventually, I'm sure, make other devices and some other people do that have higher resolution, but until you get a much bigger screen, it's, it's basically wasted. Uh, so this is crystal clear. In fact, I even met my uh, uh, partner. We live about 50 miles apart. I met him for lunch yesterday, and we were at a restaurant, and uh, he wanted to see this device that I was just you know, raving about. And, uh, uh, and they didn't have Wi-Fi in the restaurant, so I opened up my phone, and I uh, opened up the hotspot and allowed the tablet to speak to the hotspot to get to the Internet, and he was just stunned because it worked just as well as it works at home or in the gym. So anyway, uh, did I say I was a happy camper? Yeah, I think you get the idea. So if you want to save some money, get quality device, uh, go outside your comfort zone just a little bit, and I think you'll 
find that there's a world of product out there that can uh, give you what the name brands have been giving you and you've been spending money on for years and save you uh, a significant amount of money. Anyway, that's the story for today. And I uh, hope uh, uh, this works out for you or tell a friend about it. I'll put some links down below in the description on where to find this device. And uh, if you like some of the content that we have on our uh, website or YouTube channel, please like us or subscribe. Thank you very much and have a great day. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.